Hi, I'm Rural Missouri's Kyle Spradley, and this month on Out of the Way, it's with Sedalia at Katie's Barbecue. Each summer, thousands flock to this town in western Missouri for the live entertainment and carnival food at the Missouri State Fair. But just outside the gates is a place that combines the two things that first made Sedalia famous, meat and trains. Welcome to Katie's. Sedalia was founded in 1860 as a railroad town. It was once a major stop for the Katy and Missouri Pacific Rail Lines. At the intersections of Highway 50 and 65, the seat of Pettus County also was a terminus for cattle drives, as stockyards occupied a large area of the city. In honor of this history, Katy's interior is a living museum of the town's past. There is even a historic rail car that you can enjoy your meal in. You know, we have a lot of Sedalia heritage here, a lot of Missouri, a lot of local photographs, pictures. People bring me things, it's incredible. Kids love it. That's a neat thing. And they just they get the biggest kick out of it. I have a whistle they can blow up there and they go upstairs, you know, get on the train. It, they think it's great. As John and his family opened Katie's in 1969, from the hamburgers and hot dogs and root beer from the days of the drive in to the main attraction nowadays, barbecue. Out back, John's son Roger mans the smoker. For each day, they cook up pork, brisket, ham, ribs, and turkey. And you know, if they're not a barbecue people, People, they, there's so many other things on the menu they can choose. We, we do a lot of salads. We take and slice the beef, pork, or ham, or turkey, and lay it all across the salad. We do a lot of grilling of fajita, chicken. We grill peppers and onions and fajita, and we just incorporate that in the potato or in a burrito. We slice portobellas, and then we batter them and fry them. It's an appetizer, and they're really good. And we did season with a Caribbean jerk seasoning, Jamaican jerk seasoning, and serve it with a cooling. Uh, we make a house dressing, which is a sour cream buttermilk dressing. Our beans, barbecue beans, which is which it's a trademark thing. It has lots of things in it, lots of beef and pork and turkey and ham and lots of seasoning. Burger-wise, we do uh, what we call a fat Albert. We use a ground chuck, grill it, Put on provolone cheese, ham, special sauce, lettuce, tomato, pickle, and onion, and it's uh, one of our number one burger sellers. And then from there, we've gone to we use the same basic thing for tenderloins and chicken. We call it a Miss Piggy or Big Bird. And then something I I included on the menu several years ago is uh, a posh potato. Today we're going to make the society posh. Started off with the Idaho potato. We steam them for one hour. Smash them up, seasoning salt, butter, put the society meat in, which is the ends and pieces of the beef, pork, ham, and turkey, and then barbecue sauce, green onions, cheddar cheese, microwave it for about a minute and a half, dop it with a little sour cream, send it out, people love it. I really enjoy the posh, the potatoes, the wide variety of the menu, and the excellent food, the delicious food. The thing I notice about Katie's is that when you come in here, there are people of all ages, little kids, many older people eat in here regularly. There's a lot of other uh, places in Sedalia that have barbecue, but this certainly takes a time. Katie's is a family operation, and, uh, and all these people that worked here for a long time, they, they know you, they call you by name, they know what you like, and they take good care of you. Loyalty is something that's tested every day here with the, in the restaurant business. I love Sedalia. You know, it's just part of my life. So the next time you're in Sedalia, cross the tracks to Katie's for some great atmosphere and some killer food to match. I'm Kyle Spradley, and we'll catch you next time on Rural Missouri's Out of the Way Eats. Enjoy great food? Be sure to pick up a copy of Rural Missouri's Out of the Way Eats Restaurant Guide. Designed to fit in your glove box, this collection includes all restaurants featured over the years in the magazine. Available online at ruralmissouri.coop.